Today we're going to learn how to use accelerometers. You have two accelerometers here. You're going to need your DAC, your cable for your DAC, two BNC to BNC cables, then a connector to the accelerometer to BNC, to the blue wires. You're going to need this uh, PCB Piezotronics. It's a signal conditioner and it says it on front. And then you also need the little transformer for it that plugs into the wall and the core that plugs into the back of it. So the first thing we're going to do is first plug the wire into the accelerometers. So you're going to go ahead and open the box. This may already be done for you. They may have a set of weights with them already attached to it. If it's, just, if it's done like that, then you're just going to connect the wire to the one already attached to the weights. So again, you may have a weights with the accelerometer already attached to it, so you're going to want to go ahead and uh, see if it's not in the box to check the weights itself. Now to hook these up, okay, so you have your accelerometer here, you see the nut on the top, and then you see the little connector here. And then on the wire, you see this end connector, and the other end is a B and C. So you're going to take this end connector and screw it into this by pushing it and then screwing. And make sure it's tight. And that's how you attach it to the accelerometer. And you're going to do the same thing with the other accelerometer. You're going to push it in and tighten it. Once you have your accelerometer hooked up, you're going to take the BNC cable that's connected to it and you're going to connect it into the channel 1 ICP port and channel 1's on the right here. The left side of channel 1 is the output. You're going to take your BNC cable, the BNC to BNC cable, connect it to the output there. Then you're going to take the other end of your BNC cable and hook it into the AI0 port on the DAC. Then connect the DAC to your computer using the USB cable. And then once you have it connected, then you need to connect the power to the unit. And you want the connector oriented this way with the five pins on the bottom. And then you just push it in. Then you turn around the unit. And when you look on the front, you see a power button. And then you see some little light indicators. When you hit the power button, you'll notice that it'll start up. And then, if you don't have an accelerometer hooked up to the system, you will see this little open light light up, meaning it's not connected. But then once you connect the accelerometer to the system, you'll notice that the light goes out while the other channels are still lit up. So this is how you connect for a one degree of freedom. And if you want to do a two degree of freedom, then you just go on the back side, take your other cable, connect the BNC into the ICP port on this channel two, then take the other BNC to BNC cable, connect the output to channel 2, and then connect that to the AI1 port on your DAC. And that's how you would connect two accelerometers. And then on the front, you should have two lights without them saying open, with the light open being on. And you can see I have two accelerometers hooked up and none of the lights are showing, showing there's any errors. Once you're done, turn the power off and disconnect everything.